What's up guys? Welcome back to the game room. Thank you for joining me again. Today we're going to dig back into the archives because 22 years ago I bought my first home and shortly after buying that house I started modding out the walkout basement into the ultimate barcade hangout at least for me at that time within my budget and yeah I was living check to check but I still found a way to scrape money together to buy OG arcade cabinets and that's exactly what I did spanning from the early 2000s and through the 2000s and I still have my first cabinet that I bought and I will always have that cabinet for the rest of my life you guys know that is my Mortal Kombat 2 cabinet my baby everything that I had in that basement was a dedicated cabinet I was really a stickler about that at one point we had a half pipe that we built down there we used to skate all night long but you know your knees only last for so long that's the story of how I ended up where I am today why I have the game room that I have now and what got me into emulation because I had to sell all that stuff off when I moved years ago and I don't have a basement any longer so I still have a way to enjoy those games and those machines that I once had and I can do it in a more tasteful more of an adult environment adult is a relative term but you get what i'm saying so that's what kind of got me where i am today and i'm going to dig into the archives from 22 years ago i'm going to give you guys a glimpse of my og game room walkthrough back in the 2000s when a lot of these cabinets weren't even considered classics yet a lot of them were only 10 years old 15 years old now, these things are all knocking on 35 years old. I'm gonna do the best job I can. I'm missing a lot of footage, but we partied, we skated. It was the spot that I loved, I miss, and I can recreate that in the space that I have now. This is my OG game room walkthrough. Let's f***ing lose. The greatest warrior is Custom made palm trees, tiki bar. Drummer, drummer for As They Sleep. There's a singer right there smoking a doggy right there. Mortal Kombat. Basis. So I can at least say that I had it at one point. Mortal Kombat 1, 2, 3, and 4. I will not be able to part with the MK2, that's for sure. Foosball. Oh, here we go! <laughs> Alright, you guys, give me some for New Year's Eve! Huh? Oh, Breakfast New Year's. There you go, Playboy! Woo! Got the uh, little island casino here. Did you 
very first thing that ever went into the man cave, the pool table. Call me Aaron anymore, they call me Sub Zero. Pretty much Subby for short. Hey, uh, Aaron, you see my sweater? So, I mean, nothing really phases me anymore. I never go to sleep without my joystick. I mean, that's just the way it is. I mean, I gotta stay chop, chop, chop. Smack, 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 you know what I mean? Punch, punch, punch. I gotta fucking not swear. <laughs> <laughs> If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and please like, share, subscribe, all the stuff. And don't forget, you get a free eight terabyte expansion drive for your Megacade or your Extreme Home Arcade product if you're having one built. Just call and tell them that Scantron 5K sent you or on the drop down menu on that order form, go ahead and pick the Scantron 5K referral option. Get that $300 eight terabyte expansion drive for free on me. And also, if you're looking at buying a 4K pin machine from Rec Room World, don't forget to use your Scan5K code. That saves you $100 on your purchase. It's a no-brainer. Rec Room World Ultimate 4K Pinball Cabs. Use that code, save that $100. And also, grab some merch, grab some swag. I'll tag my merch store in the description of this video and I'll put some shit around it somewhere. But anyway, you guys, thank you guys so much. I'll see you on the next one. And as always, let's lose.